he used to work together along the Singapore River. You mean you used to be a waiter? Of course not. Singapore River did not have any restaurants or shops like what we have today. Last time, Akau and I were coolies working at the Singapore River. Coolies are laborers. We had to carry heavy sacks every day. You know, at that time, to earn one dollar twenty cents a day was a lot already. It's so little. Yes, times were bad then, and we were all very poor. Let me show you some pictures of Singapore River. What is this place? These are godowns where people used to store the goods to sell them to the traders and earn money. Today, these godowns have been converted to restaurants. Yes, I know. Mummy and Daddy have brought me there to eat before. There are a lot of people there. Besides food, what other activities are going on now? I read from the newspapers that an observation ferris wheel is under construction. Akau and I went there many years ago. Many old shop houses and godowns were nowhere to be seen. Shopping malls, offices, and other new buildings like the Esplanade have sprouted. Was the river clean then? There were no sewage pipes and rubbish collectors then. People were dumping their garbage directly into the river. Oil from the boats seeped into the river too. The Singapore River became dirty and smelly. In order to keep the Singapore River alive and fresh, the river was given a clean up in 1977. I have always enjoyed going to the Singapore River, but I never knew it had such a rich history. Yes, the Singapore River has reminded us of the past and has been transformed to meet the needs of people today. From then till now, it has been a lifeline for everyone. I'll be happy if young people like you find out about the rich history our river has.